<laughs> well, following the hugely successful inaugural event last year, which I took part in actually, the Tauranga International Marathon returns to one of New Zealand's favourite and fastest growing cities. Ambassadors Mike McRoberts and Vianney Bright join us now to tell us all about it. Welcome guys. Thank you very much. It's really nice to have you both here. Um, and I do know a little tiny bit about it because I did, I was an ambassador last year. I was meant to do the half marathon but hit myself did the 10k. Oh. That was hard Still enough. 10k, 10k. 10k was actually it's quite difficult. Um, but welcome to you both. Now Mike, um, this is your second year as the ambassador yeah. for the Tauranga International Marathon. So how come you, why did you get involved with it? Uh, it looked like a great run, and I love Tauranga and running around there, and um, I also knew it would be flat, so uh, it meant it would be fast, and so I, I was looking to do a good time last year and ran the marathon, um, kind of got my run all around the wrong way and went out too fast and crashed about 36 k's, but um, still came through in a really good time, so I was pleased. Yeah, we finished it, and that's a win for me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Where did the marathon running thing start for you, Mike? Because I think there's some stories about you helping someone with the New York Marathon. Wasn't yeah, it? yeah. So I, uh, I wrote a book a few years back, and the Blind Foundation asked me if I'd voice it. So it was a talking book. And uh, when I was at the Blind Foundation recording my book, I met a, a guy called Mike Lloyd, and he was training to do the New York Marathon. His training partner had gone, and so I said, look, I'll jump in and train with you. And then we trained for a bit, and um, so I was his guide. Uh, and he said, do you want to do New York with me? And I'd never run past 10Ks, I don't think, before yeah. then. So um, I said, sure. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we're actually going back to New York this year. It'll be his 10th New York marathon, wow. and wow. it'll be my fourth. So, um, yeah, it's, and it's an amazing privilege to do that. You know, it's just... It, it's actually really good because you, you are helping someone else and so you don't think about what you're doing yourself, you know. And before, oh, this has been my 13th marathon coming up for wow. the Tauranga International. Yeah, so um, yeah, you start clocking them up without realising it, which is nice. So basically Mike is me, except Mike finishes what he starts. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, no, Vianney, what about you? This is your first half marathon? Yes, definitely my first. Were you much of a runner before? Like, how did you get into it? Um, I wasn't at all. Mm. I tried to run about 3K when I first started training and... I couldn't breathe afterwards, basically. Which is so, what, he, what he does. Well, yeah, and I think, yeah, just through training and everything, I've learned that you just have to, like, set your own pace. Mm. And go slower one. than you think you should Go do. slower than you think. Um, but, yeah, I basically just got approached, and because I'm from Taronga, it's a, you know, win-win, definitely, because I know kind of we'll go around the mount, which is awesome. Yeah. Um, and, yeah, just challenging myself basically. And it's flat. Did we mention it's flat? Yeah. That's a real good bonus. <laughs> yeah. well, actually on that, Mike, tell us about the track. What's the route for the marathon? So last year, it's actually changed. Last year we, we started off at the Strand and ran around the mountain, went out to Papamoa, and this year it's going around the other way, which I think is better because mm. last year for that last half of the marathon it was quite a drag, you know, going up to Papamoa. But um, and this year will be much better and we'll be finishing amongst the crowds and that kind of thing. So, yeah, I'm, I'm really looking forward to it. And the guys from Total Sport who put on the uh, Tauranga International Marathon do an amazing job. They once got me to do the Topol Marathon, which they also run, mm. where I uh, did a jet boat um, ride through the Hooker Falls, a bungee jump and a skydive during the marathon. <laughs> It's, a, it's the only time it's ever been done, so I'm currently the world champion of that. Uh, <laughs> there needs to be a record. It took Someone... seven hours. <laughs> oh, that is excellent. Do both of you, when you run, though, this is the question I want to know, do you get that runner's high that people talk of? Do you get mm. it, Mike? Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. I feel a lot better afterwards. And sometimes towards the end, uh, most of the time, though, it's just a bit of a slog. <laughs> what about you, Viani? Because I never, ever got it. Um, I've definitely noticed it because I basically went from like doing no exercise, terrible I know, but to this and training four times a week, sometimes five. Um, yeah, when you're running, you definitely feel awesome. I feel like when you get to kind of like 8 and 10K, you're like, yes, that yeah. feels amazing afterwards. But I did my peak run before the run, which is 17 on Sunday. Wow. And I, I felt kind of tired. Mine was always after the run. Like the running, hated it, but after the run, loved it. Yes. Mm. Because the yeah. only running I do is to the fridge. So <laughs> I, well, that would be is nice there easily. options? Obviously, we've talked there as a 10k, but you know, in terms of ages and abilities, are there options for your age and stage? Yes. Um, there's a. I think there's a kids run and a fun run, which is about five or six k. Mm. And generally speaking, you get more people in those events anyway. Mm. You know? yeah. And uh, I think. To do anything is great, you know, and mm. so you, you don't have to do the marathon. I mean, it's a great thing to aspire to do, but, you know, to do 10K or to do the half and, and <laughs> challenge yourself to do that, I think is amazing. And I've got one tip for running. Good. And that is um, not so much distance, but frequency. So get out and do four runs a week. If you can yeah. do four runs a week, even if it's one or two Ks, 
you'll gradually get better and better and your body will get used to running. So people tend to go out and they'll do, they'll try and smash 10 k's in their first run. Yeah. And then it's hobble around happen. or get injured. <laughs> That's and, called know. peaking too soon, Mike. <laughs> yes, I know that all about is, that. Yeah, that uh, so just quickly tell us about the one of the partners is the charity Live More Awesome. Yeah, which is a great charity. And it's funny because a lot of people feel by doing something like running, they actually increase their mental health mm. anyway. And mm. uh, it's, a, it's a really good partnership. I think it's um, a nice fit, you know. And so, and we've been, you know, dealing with this and talking about this a little bit this year, yeah. haven't we? So, um, yeah. I know I always feel much much better mentally when I, I go out and have a run and you know and I, and I feel in good shape and that kind of thing. It's I guess it's basing it around that. Yeah, mm. definitely kind of encouraging exercise to gives you happy endorphins and yeah. you definitely notice it. <laughs> it really yeah. does. And girls, yeah. in, uh, girls who run NZ I think is another partner as well. What can you tell us about them? Yes, so um, girls, well, go run girls, girls who run NZ. Um, Marie, she's awesome. So she's been the one that wrote my training program, um, and yeah, she's so encouraging and even if there's a day where I'm like I don't know if I can do it she just pushes you and she watches me on the app so if I miss one I get in trouble. She's awesome I <laughs> love Marie. Hey well best of luck to you both. Thank you. Looking Thank you forward so to seeing your results and go for that fastest time Mike you can do it you can yes. do it. Thanks and now this year's Tauranga International Marathon takes place next Saturday the 22nd of September you can check out the website for further details.